Hello everybody and welcome back to another episode of Tutorial Part 4 Right now there's a party being thrown in my house apparently it would seem Lots of balloons and things, I don't know who's throwing the party but someone's throwing a party and I'm very happy if they're enjoying themselves, that's what matters Off camera I did a little bit of fishing like I said I would Got some items and we did, we got ourselves a new weapon, a falcon blade, it's really good, it's really really good Um, And due to having the falcon blade of course that extra attack power that I had on me Made it possible for me to finish up and clear out the way towards the what are, the word I'm looking for right now? Think, 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 think. Across the corruption. So we got a couple of more items uh, along the way. I got like a hook, which is like a, a used to um, make a grappling. If you want to make a grappling naturally, use a hook. Um, I also got some more items that we want to place inside our box, like Vow Mushrooms, Worm, Tooth, Death Weed, and we got a Soul Eater Banner 2, which was pretty cool. I'm just going to put that in our, uh, maybe like this box for now. And that's it. So that's all I got. I also got new items. We got a Balloon Pufferfish, which makes me jump higher. I've never seen this item before, so I'm assuming it's new in the game. And I also got um, the... Rash Sailfish Boots, which is pretty much the same as the other boots we had, the green ones, but this is a little bit better. Actually, I think I could take this one and probably put a different item on. And then I got a Tsunami in a Bottle, which is exactly the same as a Cloud in a Bottle. It's just called Tsunami in a Bottle, and because it's called Tsunami in a Bottle, not Cloud in a Bottle, I thought I won it. You know what I'm saying? I wanted it. So without further ado, let's get out of this horrible area that I've decided to call my base for some reason. And uh, make our way through past corruption to the other side of the ocean biome finally guys it's happening i know a lot of you were starting to wonder would we ever make it past the corruption would we see ex excuse me flying fishes can hurt me i had no idea we have two gold when the fuck did this happen um yeah we can finally get past the thing so guys check it out check how much higher we can jump boom because of this puffer fish thing it's really cool it's like insane i don't i've never i've not i've never seen it I didn't know it existed, so this is all new for me. And as you can see, I just made a little, very quick, easy path across here. It took a one one death to happen, but we have it now. And boom, pass the corruption, just like that. Into the jungle biome, baby. It's really cool. So the, with the puff of fish and the double jump, we jump so freaking far and so high now that it's like traversing is almost as if we've got like, like I almost want to say very bad wings. You know, like a bad quality wing. Not a good quality wing, a bad quality wing. So this is the jungle biome. Jungle biome is a very scary place. You want to be a little bit careful before you explore too much of the jungle biome because you'll probably just get yourself killed. Jungle biome's got a lot of very scary stuff. Ooh, nice. That's a little bit better than flippers for now, so we're going to put that on. And uh, yeah, I want everything. Loot all, baby. Loot all. Thank you. But I am going to explore the jungle biome just a bit. And the reason I'm exploring a bit is because I've got this uh, weapon. And this weapon I got is actually pretty good. So we got the weapon from fishing. I fished uh, for about 10 minutes in total. It was very fun. I had a great time. I must admit. Uh, it was nice being able to get some good quality stuff. Some good quality items. Because let's be honest. In this playthrough, I don't think I have to tell you guys. I'm so happy I just remembered I got that. Oh, I would have been dead. Okay. Uh, ooh. More chairs. Nice. A little bit of this action. A little bit of that. Nope. I will not get hit by a piranha by accident while trying to be... Not hit by one. Ooh, we're a hot crystal. Very nice. That's another max HP boost. So the jungle is like late game area. Um, you actually get the best arm in the game in the jungle area. Uh, or at least the best arm that I know of. But apparently, and I'm not entirely sure about this, but I think I might be right. I think there is a tiny chance that just maybe... Once again, I, I, I'm probably... I'm hopefully wrong. And I'm, I'm not sure. I'm literally nowhere to know. I think they might, and I actually wouldn't mind completely. I think I would actually kind of like it at the same time because it would be kind of cool to, to have more things to do. I think there's been a patch. I think they've actually patched this game and they've added shit to it because, let me tell you right now, I feel like the game is a lot harder. I feel like there's a lot more things than they w than usually were. And I feel like I am 100% actually getting my ass handed to me for change, which is I'm not used to when I'm playing Survivor. Even though I'm playing expert mode, it's still expert mode. It's not that bad. So when, I, when you are in the jungle, you got to be, I, or at least I'm going to have to be a little more aggressive than I normally am because the enemies here are really strong, like really, really strong, uh, especially the little hornets, they shoot little things out, but it's, it's insane. But yeah, we're in the jungle biome, finally, that's great, getting some more silver, which I don't really care about too much, but 
you know, we gotta get it anyway. And eventually we'll make some a full set of silver armor, a full set of gold armor. We also got a lot of ore from the fishing, because the fishing crates give you all we got. I got one golden chest in total from all my fishing experts. Exp experts? Yeah. I thought I could maybe do it, but these hornets hit just a little bit hard. That looks like a much larger hornet. What is that? A hornet? That's a hornet. They're both hornets. Look how big this one is 96 HP. It only has 85, so I guess there's different types of one with different strengths, maybe? We lost two gold, that's unfortunate, but I think an all note was worth it just to get the experience of going into a jungle and seeing what the jungle has to offer for us, actually, so I'm completely fine with that. Right, I'm just gonna uh, quick stack a lot of my stuff again. Quickly, quickly, quick stack, and put this chest over here. I don't know what for yet, that chest will just chill until we need it or something, but it's fine. We got some stinger material, which is good. Oh, that's the wrong chest, we want to put that. And that chest, what am I doing? I'm just putting the items in one chest, we can just do this. Just quick stack, I guess. Shine potion. So you can see what I'm doing right now, so I'm kind of just collecting a lot of things. Pretty much just running through the world, collecting a lot of stuff, man. All, all the good quality stuff. And the reason we, I'm doing that, of course, is for, um, is for exploration reasons. You know, I want to I see what the world has to offer, so that I know what the world's got, and then... I can uh, decide how we're gonna how we're gonna play it out. What we're gonna do? Because our first thing we need to do is obviously fight Cthulhu, right? At some point we're gonna have to fight Cthulhu, but I think fighting Cthulhu unlocks like a new part of the game, like almost the increase in the difficulty a little bit. I'm not entirely sure that I could be wrong, but I kind of get that feeling, like my brain is telling me yes, that is correct. Uh, at some point we're gonna have to make a hull elevator to go down to hull, obviously, and. Um, we're going to need to. Okay, well, we also need to think like, what what is our uh, what is our plan, our game plan? So I guess the first step is kill Cthulhu, I of Cthulhu. Then we want to come to the corruption buying, start killing the corruption, get shadow scales, and to get um, demonite ore. I think we get demonite ore from killing Cthulhu, I of Cthulhu anyway. So we want to kill I of Cthulhu. We want to get the. Um, we want to. Oops, that's a big foil. Yeah. That wasn't actually that bad. I wonder if it's a. Uh, your fall damage is calculated via your height damage, depending on how high you can jump determines how much fall damage. Also, this nice about this Falcon Blade is you can kind of hold it in. You don't have to push the button, it works automatically. So, so I'm obviously not going to go in there again, there's no need. I really got what I, I wanted. I wanted to see a little bit of the jungle. We got an extra life because that was just alone, that was like already a bonus. Just gonna we're going to continue exploring the jungle to the other side to get to that ocean. I feel like every time I play Terraria, though, my jungle biome's always on the right side. Is that like, is that always like that, or is that, is it like random? I don't know. We didn't get any desert pyramids in this, uh, let's play. I barely get desert pyramids. What's uh, another person play Terraria? And they got two desert pyramids in the same fucking game. I'm like, what? I get them like once in a lifetime, and then the ones I get never have items in either. I did play my friend, well, and he got a desert biome, and then his desert biome, he got a, uh, he got a, what's it called? He got the flying carpet, which is pretty cool. I thought it was pretty cool, so. I was like, congratulations, dude. That's uh, kind of a little on the rare side, you know? It's not something you see every day when you play Terraria, but, you know. So, congratulations. I don't know what, I don't know if there's like some kind of ultimate thing you can get from a. Uh, ooh, I'm actually fine. There's a biome right now. So, it's so great. Anti manable nice. Riley the Traveling Merchant is the part. Oh, no, I didn't know Riley the Traveling Merchant was there. I have so much gold, guys. In one of my chests I got from fishing, it had 25 gold coins in. It just had 25 gold coins in, just like that. For no particular reason at all, it was like, here, I have 25 gold coins. And I was like, okay, that sounds great. I'm going to do it, you know, I'm going to take it. But at the same time, I was questioning, like, hmm, seems a little bit too good to be true, you know what I'm saying? Do we jump so high with these fucking buffs that I've got? Is this all? I don't know. I guess you can find iron ore quite often on the top of on the top floor, but you know you never find uh, like silver or anything on the top floor. I guess it makes sense. Like I think if you found if you could find silver on the top floor, that'd be a little bit. Different. I know it's very dark now. I do apologize about. It. I I I'm assuming you can't see very nicely. I know. I'm so sorry. Ooh, we even found a, a, tr a living tree. Nice. We found a living tree, ladies and gentlemen. Nice living tree. I'm very excited. Take this jump. Take this jump. Take this jump. Loop. Easy. Dude, it's insane when you can jump so high how much progress you can make in the game. So living trees are kind of cool. They kind of give you like a little bit of a free home, almost. I like living trees. They also like, it gives you kind of like a incentive of, or something to go. Like, hey, look, here's a, here's a direction. Go down here and explore, do you know what I'm saying? Uh, I quite often make my base in living trees because it's just convenient. But it's kind of like 
I don't want to say overdone because that would be really weird, but you know, many, many people do it. Many, many people do it. They make their bases inside the uh, living trees, and then you just feel like, I feel like the living tree just doesn't have that that same nuance because it's so overly used. You know what I'm saying? But maybe, you know, it's also just could be my opinion. Maybe I'm being a little bit biased. Yeah, it's definitely possible, but I don't know. I'm not gonna do a living tree base. I didn't. I, I thought about it for a little bit, like. Uh, in, uh, especially for me, I don't I don't make living tree um, bases. What I do is I actually make um, I make tree house bases. I make my bases in the tree house. Oh, now we're finding all the chests, game. Thank you so much for all these useless items and late game that absolutely serve zero purpose for me. I really appreciate it. What does the armored radar do? Uh, it detects enemies around you. Okay, we can take that over this, I guess. Climbing claw. What were you giving me, climbing for? Movement speed. We don't care about movement speed. What were you giving me? Defense! It's way better. We have 12 defense now. I like how now I'm getting all the chests. All the chests were just on this, hidden on this side of the map, it seems. This whole time I've been looking for chests and they're all just hidden on this side of the map. Is this a sea biome or is this just a big ass lake? We should throw some uh, eights down there. Yo, eights! Get down there. Show me what you got. Nothing. Nothing specific. Bloop! Speed the system up. So let's speed the system up. God damn it. Okay, this is kind of awkward. I'm gonna have to dig my way out. I'm gonna have to dig my way out, don't I? This might be a little bit tricky. Kind of stuck here, it's all these, like, demonized fuck off. Okay, one down. There we go. One more to go. There we go. We did it. We're the world's greatest game. We should probably make some kind of like option here or we are fucked. What about if we do something like this? There we go. Beautiful. Fuck that shit. And also put a torch as we're doing. Ooh, hello. Is this a desert biome or is this this ocean now? I think we found the ocean. Yeah, no ocean. It might be a desert though. What is this? Does this hole look suspicious to you guys? I'm just saying, I'm looking at it and I'm like, it looks suspicious. Let's blow it up, baby. Nines all the way. Let's go. Oh wait, that was actually a bad idea, I didn't realize it. Lucky, just in time. No, you're not getting me. Actually, you did give me a little bit, but that's okay. I will end you. I will end all of you. Understand? I will end all of you. I've got a falcon blade and I'm not afraid to use it. You know what I'm saying? Dude, where? What is this demon eye spawn? Holy crap, look at this. You guys ever seen this many demon eyes in one area? It's crazy. It's crazy. But, is it because it's like, I'm in the desert maybe? Maybe the desert has high spawn rates? I don't know. I, need, I probably should know, know these things, but... Like I said, I'm just playing for a casual playthrough. We're just gonna plan to the moon lord. We're not gonna be trying to. We're not gonna be trying anything fancy. Get to the moon lord, kill the moon lord, relax, have a good time. You know what I'm saying, dude? Okay, we get it. There's demon eyes. They're everywhere. We have to fucking understand, dude. It's fine. It's, so you guys can get rid of the. Stop it. Stop it. Stop with the fucking demon eyes, really. I'm just saying. It's it's too much. It's too much now. A little bit of a star. We like stars. Stars give us options. Find some stuff here. Ooh, that looks like an underground bio. It kind of is, like a mini one, I guess. Hey, we're actually getting some decent stuff now. Now we're getting all the good stuff, guys. What the fuck? Why do I have to play the game for like two million years suffering and having the worst playthrough ever? You, you could have just given me the good stuff right off the bat. Why don't you just give me the good stuff out of the bat game? I don't understand. We're getting all that good quality things right now, man. I'm having like a great time now. Now it's like, yeah, baby. Wait, wait, fuck this. I'm not going to dig down and get distracted. We are going to the ocean today. No matter what. Okay, I'm not getting distracted yet. Was that a purple demon eye? Get fucking wrecked, Mr. Purple Demon Eye. What the fuck do you think you're cool because you're purple? Listen to me. And I tell you, I don't care if you're purple. I'll kill all of you. Hey, we found the freaking ocean. Nice. Okay. So what you want to do with the ocean is very simple. You get eight out. We have a... We don't. Okay, so you got to guess and you go. No, no, no. No, wait. We actually need more speed. We need we need a lot of speed so we can be fast. We need to be fast. I guess. Check it out, so you go da 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 and then you jump, jump, 
And they da 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 The reason we do that is now because all this will light up. And we will know exactly where the, the chest are. So we can go boop. Do it all. Quickly dig out the chest. Da -da 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 -da. Get this out and go, 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 Eights all the way. Eights, 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 eights. Eights, 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 eights. Get to the end. You don't see. Oh, there's another chest. I think I knew there'll be another chest. You loot it quickly. Get the chest. You go. I died? How did I die? Shock food. But there's no shocks. I don't understand. How did I die? There was no shocks. Well, shock food. I don't care. We got all. We got the two chests and we made it to the ocean. In my opinion, that's a win. In my book, this is a win episode. Okay, we won. Check the map out, baby. Let's do it. Blah, blah. Oh, look at that. So we got ourselves a jungle biome. We got two cor uh, corruption. Corruption. And corruption. We have a, a, a dungeon. We have two. Uh, where you can go down there to explore. By a tree. We have a little snowy area. Our snow area is very small. Wow. Lots of desert areas, but only one little tiny snow area. I should, should probably protect that snow area with my life. Um, yeah, not not bad, not bad. I think that was an amazing one, guys. Look at all the shit we got. Look at this. We are so wealthy now. Look, boom! Look at this. It's crazy. Let's see if we can put anything away so we can like maybe have to not think as much. Cause I, I you know, thinking is not one of my strong points to start off with. I think this much is going to be very difficult for for me. Uh, quick stick, no. Hey, quick stick, no. What is this last chest? I don't even know what this last chest is. Okay. So we have, uh, armored angled types and movement speed. Ooh, that's pretty good. Chuk -chuk run super fast. I guess we can take this off because armored angle gives more defense now. So this can go into our, uh, what's it called, a chest? Uh, living, uh, chest go here, living wood chest and water chest. The trident is a weapon, but it sucks. So we'll put in the, the weapon chest for now. We don't really care. Even though it's useless, breathing weed is also useless. Now, where's the useless chest? Where did I put the... Oh, no. I think I'm a bit... Where did I put the umbrella? I sold the umbrella, didn't I? I fucking sold it. I know I did. Okay. Let's just put it here because even though it's useless, it's kind of like a, a item. A strong blowpipe is also useless, but whatever. Uh, what else we got? An uh, archery potion. Ooh, that's going to be useful for the Cthulhu fight. Uh, uh, leaf one consume and place wood, yeah, okay, whatever. Uh, I think we put that in a block area because it is technically like block, I guess. Also, let's make a mana star. Use mana star, we're up to 100 mana already. Oh, yeah, but we've got an anti mandible. Go in the consumable pit, and the seeds go here too. And strange probably just give the die, dude. Let's do this. I, what happened to my. What happened to my. Uh, oh, did I store them? Yes, I saw them. Also, my recall potions. We never want to store recall potions. Let's make sure we never do that. Okay. Um, we can get rid of the rep. We can get rid. Of, yeah, we can pretty much get rid of all of this. So let's just a uh, quick stack this. Why is my sand not getting quick stack? There should be a sand department where my sand gets quick stack into. If I misplace the sand somewhere else, sand? Did I withdraw the sand and make a blocks of it? I don't think I did, but maybe. I mean, I'm looking and I'm like, what the hell? Okay. Uh, let's just quickly see if we can make anything better armor-wise here. Yeah. So we can make up to a gold broadsword or a gold short sword. I don't think we need that because we have a uh, falcon blade, which is already better. I guess we might want a gold bow for the boss fight coming up, I guess, maybe. I don't know. Uh, we should make more of this first. This is this. Easy. And then uh, more of iron bars. Oop. I don't know why I'm making these. I don't think I need them. But I'm doing it anyway. But I might not want to. Because I think we might be able to use these later to make like golden bricks or stuff like that. Which we might actually want. You know. I'm just saying. But I should probably have thought about that a little bit earlier before I actually click the button. Did I just throw away something again? I don't think so. Wait. Can I make any golden armor? I cannot make any golden armor. Can I make silver armor? I can make silver armor. Should we make a full set of silver armor? What have I got? Iron armor and iron. Okay, let's make a full set of silver then. Silver. I literally am out of silver after making one item. Are you kidding me? Silver, hello? Okay, we need more silver. Very clearly the big problem we're having right now in the game is we do not... We very clearly do not have enough silver. We should... Ooh, we should make a sticky dynamite. Yee, sticky dynamite. Oh, man, I like sticky dynamite. We make some sticky bombs too. Can they be very useful later on? Okay, and then... Uh, is there anything else we want to make here before we leave and go on another uh, exploration expedition? Oh, where's our armor? 15 armor. Now I'm unkillable. 
Now that I'm unkillable, I feel like I can go explore the world. You know what I mean? Now that I can't actually die, I feel like now it could be a good idea to go explore the world. Let's go given uh, all the stuff we have on us, see if there's anything new. We should also, um, I should also make glass panes so we can uh, finish up the base and stuff there. Let's just do this for now. Blip, blip, and let's go. Sweet. I also do need to try and make a bed at some point because honestly, I, will, I wouldn't mind a bed so that I could like not have that be my base i guess it's fine that that's my base but at the same time i do understand that i'm at some point probably gonna need an actual proper base okay let's continue checking that everything's done looks like it okay uh, let's check housing suitability now. Question mark. Question mark. Housing suitable. Housing suitable. Housing suitable. Oh yeah, baby. Look at this. It's beautiful. Beautiful start of our glass castle, ladies and gentlemen. It's going to happen. It's just taking a little longer. To spare, but it's going to happen. Let me make this very clear. I'm so sorry, animals. I didn't want to kill you. It was, wasn't my choice. I had no choice. They uh, forced my hand. Where is... I Can I turn... I thought I could turn glass panes back to normal... Stuff, but it doesn't look like I can. Where's the merchant? Merchant there. I know merchant. I need to sell some of you some stuff. So you can have you can have this, you can have this, you can have this, and you can have uh, you can actually have my shokens. I'm done with shokens for the whole game, I think. Uh what is slot seven? Slot seven? What is slot seven? Hello? I don't know what the fuck is in, supposed to be in slot seven. Yep, die guy. Die guy! I'm not nurse go on oh, heal anyway, but that guy was up. Strange plant. Strange plant. Shop. Did he do it? He did. He gave me acid die. You know we gotta go for acid die, ladies and gentlemen. We wanna be green, baby. Do we wanna be green? I don't know. La la la. Oh yeah, that looks that looks fucking awesome. We're gonna be green boys. Let me just. No, I cannot. No. Nope. Okay. I want to. I, I need to find a place to store that the dies. Okay. And then uh, is that it? Is that all I'm doing? Okay. I think that's all we're doing. What have I pushed all the wrong buttons? I'm I, I. I don't know what I've done. Forgive me again. Oh no, enemies now. Ooh, I actually forgot about that. Okay. So map, map, map. What's our next goal? Ne we're going down to hell where I keep dying because now I've got this. And no, wait. Why am I taking the long route? There's a safe, easy route. So you guys need to let me know in the comments below if you want me to show off when I make like fighting arenas or if I make pass. Is that a like just in case I don't have this? Even though I probably there's no way I don't have it, but just in case I don't have it. Uh, if you guys want me to do the like the when I build these type of pass or make clear out the corruption, etc. etc. If you guys want me to do that on camera, let me know in the comment section below. And I can like make this better footage or some background music if you want to see like how I make my elevator. If you want to see how I make my farming zone, stuff like that, let me know in the comments below and I, I will show that off. If you don't, I'm just going to edit most of that out because it's very time consuming. It's not very enjoyable in my opinion. Kind of like this run, but you know, it's something that has to happen. It's part of the game. So eventually I'm going to clean this all up off camera, most probably. I'm going to dig out all the sand, all the dirt and place like brick, uh, grey bricks because I like grey bricks quite a lot. I think they're very pretty. I keep forgetting I can jump very high, but I can't fucking, um, what's it called? I don't have zero damage. Four, zero four damage. I just have, like, very high jump. I kind of keep forgetting that, so it's kind of a big problem. So we got the movement aglet now. We've got, yeah, we got, we got a lot of good stuff, man. Having the movement aglet so early is really cool, because it's kind of like an item I u usually find that I struggle to get hold of. It's kind of like one of those, like, I love it, but I can never get my hands on it. You know what I mean? Okay. Map me up, baby. Where are we going? To this ele ele elevator. Elevator? Escalator? Mm. Dude, I jump so high, I think I, I think I double jump just to find out I don't. Know. Also, look how, look where we jump. You see that water from the double jump? That's tsunami in a bottle, baby. It's kind of, I think, it's supposed to be a kind of a referency type thing to my boy Duke. What's his face? Which is. Oh, that is some ruby right there, baby. Ruby, 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 ruby. Da, 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 da. Da, 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 da. Not to worry. I love this game. Don't get me wrong. It's a very, very risky game to play. 
Because before you know it, all of a sudden you've invested 6,000 hours of your life and you can never get it back. And it's very addictive. Especially if you find little fucking silver deposits like this where you're just like, Oh, hello, it's free silver deposit man that I just met. What's up? And it's like, yo, what's up? And then next thing you know, you're getting married to the silver deposit. You're freaking giving up your freaking whole life for the silver deposit. Everything's just not the way it's supposed to be. So it's not right. It's not right. Don't, don't, do not let the silver deposits blackmail you with their sexy or and pretend like they're helping you. When I mean, you all know, let's be honest, the silver deposit had no intention of actually helping me. Now, why am I making silver? I want to have silver leggings. That's why I'm getting silver. You, and just in case you guys are wondering, why is he going through the effort of getting silver? All he does is complain about the silver. And I just took 78 fucking damage because I misclicked, which is very painful. We found an ice biome. Hmm. Do I want to be in the ice biome? Hmm. Not really. Should I leave the ice biome? I should, but I just saw gold, baby. Now, if gold, though, on the other hand, promises to love you and marry and hold you for life and ever and ever, just say yes. Don't say no. Don't be an idiot. Why you do this? Why you do this? Do you know who I am? I'm Falcon Blade. Falcon Blade. So the Falcon Blade is really good. It's actually a item you get from the Pirate Invasion. And the Pirate Invasion is... I think it's pre-hard mode, but I'm not actually entirely sure because I basically cannot remember. So let's just say it is. And that way, if it's not... Yo, Bats, I will kill you before I make progress. I don't want you guys to annoy me. What now, Mr. Bat Boy? Lol. Bye. I'm out of here. We. I was trying to think, wasn't there something I wanted yet? I actually didn't know that worked like that. I just learned something new. Bottom five, let's go. Wait, wasn't there a spider biome somewhere here? Who the fuck's the spider biome? I want my revenge on these fucking spiders. Spiders? Oh, you don't even know. You don't even know, spiders. It's, it's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Oh, first I need to get through here. I would like a bit of pickaxe, though. I'm not gonna lie to you. So what items are we still looking for? Uh, we can still get a couple of type of claws and I think there's there's still some items. There's not many items we can still get. I mean that's the item we don't have, the bracer thing, so that's great. What is this? What the fuck was that? A corrupt statue. I don't think I ever want a corrupt statue. I'm just gonna tell you right now again. On a scale of one to ten, I don't think I'm ever gonna be sitting here like, oh you know what I wish I had today? A fucking corrupt statue. No, I made a critical, I didn't say it was fucking water. Oh that's actually fine, it ended up being okay. Let's see what's in here. Hello? Is that, is that gold? Is this gold? I feel like it's... What is these noises? Do you guys hear these noises? Do you guys, do you guys hear these noises? Or just me? Please tell me it's not just me. Please tell me I'm not the only one that hears, hears these noises. Is that a salamander? Uh, was that the granite dude? I can't tell if it's a salamander or granite dude. It sounds like a salamander. I don't see no salamander though. So, you know. I'm asking questions. I want to know what that noise is. You know, it's a very scary sounding fucking noise, and I'm very worried about it. Ruby? No, I'm gonna flood myself, aren't I? Eight, eight it up. Okay, I'm not gonna flood myself. Was debate? Is this another Ruby? Bi I got another gem biome. Are you serious right now, game? I mean, I have all these noises too, but at the same time, who cares? I'm getting a fucking gem biome, baby. Yeah. Oh, diamond. Diamond? What? I mean, it's not like Minecraft where diamond is like the ultimate, but don't, don't get me wrong. Diamond in Terraria at least is pretty fucking rare. Like, I, I've, I've always wanted to make like a diamond, um, anything like a diamond pickaxe. Not a diamond pickaxe, obviously. I'm fucking, oh my god, Minecraft, what have you done to me? Now I'm fucking calling it diamond pickaxe. There isn't such a thing as a diamond pickaxe in, in fucking Minecraft. And here I am calling it fucking diamond, diamond pickaxe like a literal retard. Okay, anyway, uh, all retardation, me aside. There is no such thing as a diamond pickaxe, guys. I'm not playing. Yeah, we are not playing fucking... Dude, I'm kind of busy right now. I don't know if you noticed, but... There's diamonds here, man. There's, there's literal diamonds. Kind of diamond biome. Which I don't think I've ever seen before, in all honesty, so... I will, I will end you! I will end your life! He bought it on himself, ladies and gentlemen. I wasn't gonna do it. I was gonna live and live, you know? I was gonna be, I was gonna be that nice guy who lets people live, but then... He fucking pissed me off. Okay, did I get all the diamonds here? Very important that we know if we got all the diamonds here. I feel like we did. Oh no. How do I? There's literally diamonds right here. I almost missed. I will never miss diamonds. Oh my word, dude. I have, I've actually. I don't think. In all my years of playing Terraria. I've got a diamond biome that gave me 21 diamonds. 
ever, by the way. Ever. Uh, I've made a critical error and I regret every decision I've ever made in my whole life. No. What's up? No, that's what I call speed farming, guys. Or speed uh, digging. It kind of worked out, kind of didn't work out. Where am I going? Spider biome. Spider biome! I'm coming for you, Mr. Spider biome. Is that a Shelly? That is a fucking Shelly. Oh, I can't deal with the Shelly right now. Actually, I can. I'm, I've got a false on. I don't care. What's up, Shelly, bitch? What's up? Yeah, that's what I thought. Is that a is that a mom? Is that a mom slime? A bitch, I don't care with no mom slime. Ring it. You think it's tough? You think it's tough? I got a falcon. You think it's tough? I got a fucking falcon. I know. I was scared of you. Okay, I'm a little bit scared of you. Yeah, I'm kind of semi terrified right now. I made a critical episode. Oh my god! That did 80 damage. That did 80 fucking damage. I'm dead. I'm dead. G. I'm dead. It's poison. It's poison and, and bad. It's poison and bad combo. Poison and bad combo. Poison and bad and granite. Poison and bad granite combo. There's a trap. There was a trap there. Poison dart trap, obviously. It was very clearly a poison dot trap. I will not die to poison dot today. I refuse. You gotta take a slow, ladies and We need to take a slow. See where this, where's the trap? Where's the trap? I see a trap. Got him. Ah, if I can catch you, Mr. Trap Boy, what now? Where are you, Mr. Trap? What's up, Mr. Fucking Granite Boy? You think I'm gonna die? You think I'm gonna die? I'm not dying. I'm not dying. I might be on 15 HP. I might be on 16 HP. It might look like I'm dying. I'm not dying. Not today. Not today, game. Yeah, there's a piranha. Bah, you fucking bet! Oh my god, I got killed by a piranha on land! I got killed by a piranha on land! What? What? Where's the trap? I don't even see the trap. That's the worst part. I don't know where the fucking trap the shopping was. Who okay, cares? So we got 21 fucking diamonds. 21 diamonds? 21 diamonds! Have you guys ever seen 21? No, you haven't. Exactly. Okay, go on. 21 uh, Excuse me, is that a fucking golden bunny? Is that bunny Like purple? Are you a purple bunny? Are you like some kind of special god bunny? Nope, you just dead. Okay, never mind. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to kill you like that. Okay, um, okay, we were busy doing stuff doing stuff. Anything I need to put away here? No. Wait, where's our crap chest? Yeah, crap chest. We got a bunch of crap. Get all the crap inside the crap chest. That's why we made it. Nice, I actually like that. Let's put that there. I always put new accessories that I'm not using. Um look how much money I have by the way. I'm fucking I'm fucking wealthy. I'm so wealthy. If the traveling merchant ever comes around, dude. Oh my god, you don't understand. Wait, this is not potions. This is I wanna see what I can make of diamonds though. Large diamond or a diamond hook? What the fuck is a large diamond? For capture the gem. It drops when you die. Uh, no. That sounds horrible. Um, where do I... Where am I currently stocking my... Uh, what's my call of my thing, my jeez? My, um... What are, what are diamonds sell for? I should actually check. My banners. Banners. Ban banners. Here we go. Banners. Slime banner. Okay. Um, that's fine. This can... Oh, check all this. Get the fuck out of here. Yo, Mr. Merchant Boy, how much will you give me for 21 fucking diamonds, dude? Remember, diamonds are almost impossible. Just keep this in mind, Mr. Merchant Boy. Shop. Diamonds. Six got Six got for Are you fucking kidding me? What do you want? Caught in the surface. What is this? Uh, out in the forest, I was fishing right. Well, I guess what? A bunny hopped up to me. Then another one hopped up. And another. Suddenly, I'm surrounded by bunnies. One even swam to me from the water. Quest it up, baby. Let's go. Give me my... I need bait. I need bait. We need bait. Get the bait. The bait's in the bait tray. Bait it up. Put the diamonds away because we're not going to be using these diamonds. Because apparently they're useless. And then I need a potion. I need one fisherman potion. Okay, let's go. There's a bunny. What's up, bunny? I must go find your kind now and, and uh, not murder them. Just, just do things to them that uh, normal people might consider wrong for a bunny. But, you know. Life happened, bunny boy. Life happened. Someone was going down. It wasn't going to be me. Okay, fishing time. So we need to catch a bunny fish for this dude. So let's try and get it done. Do -do 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 we got the bunny fish absolutely immediately on our first go. So I'm going to farm a little bit more. And then we got a wooden crate. Boom. We got three iron skin potions. That's so good. So I'm going to use a fish potion. And I'm going to fish this up. I'm going to speed this all up so you guys won't see it.
and we're back off to what must be the most disappointing fishing of all time. We're finishing the quest, which is great, which we got the uh, apprentice bait for, and I didn't see what else we got. I think a little bit of gold, maybe? But basically, a very depressing fucking fishing expedition, because, let's be honest with each other, we didn't get much. There's another one, there's another plant, like, right here, we should probably, probably get up, but, uh, a little bit upset that, uh, I mean, I went fishing, and then I got fucking nothing. So that one was kind of frustrating, but what can you really do about it? So another strange plant got, which means more dice. So this is Mirage. I will check Mirage out in a bit. It was up. I got, I got potentially more dead. But we get negative die. Sounds awesome. I want to know what negative die does. I also want to know what Mirage die does. Which is a. I thought you could just right click this. Apparently you can't. So we're gonna check out negative die and we're gonna check out mirage die. Let's check out mirage die first. Uh, it does nothing. It does nothing. Oh, I've kind of got like a glow, like a weird glow. I don't like it. I feel like it's not really doing very much, but it's okay. we're getting a bunch of cool dies, which is cool. I mean, I don't know what it. If it's really that cool, but I'm just gonna say this. And then we have negative that. Oh, that looks like okay, that's the one I want. Yes, I look like something fucking out of a crazy store. I love it. I love it so much. Okay. Put our dies away because we don't need it. And we're gonna quick stack all our atoms. Quick stack. So let me know what you guys thought about how I did that fishing thing. Is that fine? Can I do it like in the future? Or do you wanna actually like have commentary while I'm fishing and see what I'm doing when I when I pick up items or choose not to pick up items? What is this? Crate potion. Ooh, crate potion. Now that is what I'm talking about. Give me some of those actions. You know what I'm saying? A little bit of crate action potions are going to get all the quality good stuff. So, silver bar. And we'll have plan of ore, which is odd because we're never going to be using plan of ore. Can I make a uh, fucking silver pants yet? Can I? Please. Please, for the love of the Lord, give me a silver pants. I need it. I need a silver pants. I still can make a silver pants? What is this game, man? All I want is a silver pants. And like, how about no? Okay, so, ooh, we can make gold pants, though. Ooh, I like how we can make a gold pickaxe. <gasps> we can make a gold pickaxe! Yes! Fuck, get the fuck out of here. Sup oh, that's a superior? Oh, that was fine. Oh, we can make a gold pickaxe, ladies and gentlemen. We are making super game progress right now. I might actually just be the best tomorrow play in the history of the world of the entire gaming world of the history. Very cool. I think we got a lot of money out of the fishing like 11 gold so that was kind of worth it but still not enough to make me excited about it you know what i mean but anyway so uh yeah let's go we're going to go play some money away before we lose it so we're gonna be negative it looks kind of odd i'm not gonna lie to you but i'm kind of it's kind of growing on me a little bit i don't know maybe let's just say yes uh quick stack we have 38 gold dude when the fucking uh dude comes around we're gonna be able to buy illegal gun parts right off that which is crazy so what's our next goal Oh, back to the where we died. Back to where we died to take the elevator right. Wait, I'm taking the wrong route again. I'm taking the wrong route. I keep doing this over and over. What is the point of making the world's greatest route if I never use it? You know what I mean? Anyway, I'm going to see you guys at the elevator or the little railway ride. And I'll see you guys in a jiffy. And I changed my mind once I made it to this area. And I realized I'm a god gamer and no one could ever, ever even hope to compete with me. I was like, you know what I want to do, baby? I was like, if I don't land in water, I'm gonna die. And then I didn't land in water, and I still didn't die, which is great. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna head to the spider biome and get my revenge on the spiders for last episode. How dare those spiders think they can kill me and get away? Do they know who I am? Wait, where is the spider biome anyway? Where in the right? Yes, I just need to go around to the water. Where's eight? Eight? No! Why is there Viking here? No undead vikings. No undead vikings. We do not allow undead vikings in our homes. Granite boy, get the fuck out of here. I'm going to spider land. Yo, spiders. What now, Mr. Spider boys? You guys were also tough. Weren't you so tough, Mr. Spider boys? Huh? Huh, Mr. Spiders? Where are you now? Where are you now? Bring it. Bring it. Okay, I'm a little bit scared. I can't see shit. Okay, bring it now, Mr. Spider boys. I'm fucking ready for you. I'm ready. I'm, I'll destroy you. I'll destroy all of you. As I know where the fuck I am and what's going on, but once I do, let me let you know, Mr. Spiders, it's going, it's going down right now. Me versus you, Spiders boys. Let's do this. We're gonna have so many cobwebs. Oh my god. Oh yeah. Look at this. 
I, I pretty much own the spider base now. You see, the spiders ran over like little bitches. They knew I was coming. They were so scared. They were like, we're sorry. We're leaving. We're getting out of the way. We can never compete with you. Spider Slayer 2720. 20, 20. I'm, I'm, I'm just the absolute best spider. This is the worst spider biome ever. There's nothing in it. Hello? Hello? Use the spider biome? Excuse me? Is it literally a spider biome with nothing in? There's no way, right? Okay. What is this? Salt blocks. Yo, sp where did the spiders go? And where is my spider chest? And where is the gold that I'm supposed to save in the spider biome? I came to get my revenge on the spiders once I was strong enough and now the spiders ran around like little bitches. Did they pussy out because they saw how amazing ultimate and strong I was? Ah, <sighs> spiders, they have no honor. You can never trust the spider, ladies and gentlemen. Never trust the spider. They are untrustable. Untrustworthy, I tell you. But I mean, they're so ugly. Why do they have to be so ugly? That's the worst part. Of they just made spiders look cute, you know, to solve all the problems that spiders have. But spiders, is they look so ugly. Like, I mean... Can we blame people for hating spiders? I don't think so. I think, technically speaking, we can't even blame people for hating spiders. It's not allowed. You're not allowed to hate them because they're freaking ugly. They bought it on themselves. Ooh, we found a little bit of an amethyst deposit. Very nice, very nice. Lots of gems and all this game. Like, all the gem and all the ore, but none of the items. I mean, we got a bunch of items now recently because we've been able to explore because we finally got powerful. But our early game sucked the big one. Just didn't get anything. It was kind of just frustrating, honestly. Do I have any bombs? Can I just speed this fucking process up maybe, please? Boom, get the fuck in there. Thank you. Boom. I found the spider biome! This will be it. I made a cooker. Oh. Found the rest of the spider biome, ladies and gentlemen. Bring it. Wait, that might not actually be a spider. It is a spider biome. It is a spider biome? It's not a spider biome? I kind of, I kind of, I kind of actually just can't tell what kind of biome that is. It could be a spider biome, or it could just be a little, like, hoplite biome. It might actually just be a hoplite biome. Who okay, cares? Let's go. I'm ready. I'm ready. Bring it on, spiders. Oh no! What now, Mr. Spider Boys? You guys all thought you were so tough. That whole time giving me shit about how tough you are. Oh look at you! I'm a, I'm a, I'm a spider boy. Oh no! What am I supposed to do? He's, he's the world's greatest enemy. There's nothing I can do. There's literally nothing I can do about it. Dude, why is there ice everywhere I go, okay? I hate the ice. The ice is all the strongest enemies in the game, man. The ice is the most horrible place to play the game. Because it sucks. Oh, I'm gonna go there. That looks way better. There's a single random spider there. But other than that, that place looks so much safer than this ice shit. This, this ice biome. I'm telling you right now, I think the hardest biome in the game is ice biome. In my personal opinion. And my professional gamer opinion. Uh... Best game in the world to opinion, just every opinion that matters basically. Um, the spider, the spider biome is a piece of shit, but other than that, the ice biome is the hardest biome in, in, in Terraria. First of all, you get slowed in the ice water, which is just shitty, right? You don't want that, that just sucks. I mean, no, nowhere else do you get elementals just from being in the area, it doesn't exist, right? But it does in the ice area, and you know what also sucks? I'll tell you what sucks, I'll tell you right fucking now what sucks. The freaking Ice hard mode is the most impossible shit you've ever experienced. There's all these enemies and they're all very strong and they all want to kill you. Don't ask me why. You did nothing to them. You just met them, you know, you were trying to have a casual time and they were like, what's up? And then they literally attack you and try and kill you. This is the shit you're doing. Excuse me, Mr. Bat Boy. I will end you. Don't even, don't even think about it. Ooh, isn't you die? Another die, baby. Getting all the dies. I mean, if we're, ooh, night out push. That's actually useless so right now. I don't know how it works. How does the night push work? It works! Okay, good. We can- Ooh, it actually looks pretty good. So we're gonna get this gold up here because I want gold. 13! 13 enemies nearby game? Thir you thought 13 enemies nearby was like a fucking fair game. I'm one person. How am I supposed to fight 13 people? This is bullshit. Okay, let's be careful about traps. We don't want to die to some random fucking trap. Something that I can't fucking see again. Like, I've died 9,000 times in this game already. Yo, Prana, remember that time you killed me because you were on land? I'll fucking kill you in the water, bitch. Now what, huh? Now what? You were so strong until I killed you in your own fucking environment. Now you're useless. Now you're fucking useless. What now? Okay, I'm still not entirely sure what I'm doing in Terraria right now. I kind of feel like a little bit of like one of those people that don't... That I don't have a goal in life right now. I just gotta... My goal is pretty much just fucking do whatever the fuck I want. Have fun. 
Which I guess is the best goal, and but it was also like questionable. It's like, am I gonna make any progress in this game ever? You know, I don't want to have another Persona situation where it's fucking. I want to hey, let's make a quick let's play Persona, guys. I'm very excited because I like Persona. It's a fun game, and it's like 100 episodes later. Don't get me wrong, I enjoyed those 100 episodes of Persona. It was really fun, and the game is really good, and I really like it. But it's like it kind of messes up my gaming schedule because now I'm releasing three videos a day on my channel, and it's just like it's too much content, baby. And you know stuff like that but i mean i don't know is kind of is there such a thing as too much content i think I, i'm like i do feel like i'm putting out too much content at the moment but at the same time i also feel like that means i'm getting more of an exposure because different content means different people might that like certain contents will see my channel that didn't see it before because i didn't make the content they liked before type situation so it's a big it's a very fine balancing act i feel you know what i'm saying and I feel like right now I'm just ending it just fan, just fan. Didn't you dare put on my torch? No one puts on my torch and lives to tell the tale about it. The tale of what the fuck is that guy? Are you carrying a di? Are you carrying a diamond inside you? What are you carrying inside you? I mean, this is the most ultimate en sli enemy. I'm gonna die to a fucking slime. I'm gonna die to a motherfucking slime. Okay, it's unacceptable. Oh my god, this cobwebs. No, my god, I can't see shit. Whee. I see you, Mr. Trap Boy. Not today. Not today. The trap thought he was going to get me. I bet you guys. He was like, I'm going to get him. I'm going to get him. I was like, what now, Mr. Trap Boy? Not today. What is this? It looks like a granite biome to me. A second granite biome? A second granite biome, I guess. Okay, let's go. Going through the second granite biome. Don't know if it's good or bad yet. We're gonna find out very soon. Digging up into the second granite biome. I see water in the second granite biome. Gonna lose all my pictures. And by pictures, of course, I mean my torches. I only lost one torch. Not that bad. Not that bad. Let's place a couple on here. I right, say down here. Say down there. There we go. Blah blah blah. blah. Blah, blah, blah. Blah, blah, blah. Okay. Torch it up. Torch it up. Torch it up. But you don't want to fight me. Dude. Trust me. Trust me this one. What did I get? Water water, 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 walking potion. Lol. He's gone forever. That's the end of that guy's life. Sucks to be you, man. Got another heart crystal. Gonna get that max HP up to 240. I'm just really good at this game. I'm actually figured out. I'm actually really good at this game. That's the secret, guys. The secret is you just need to be really good, like me, and you'll be fine. If you're not good, like me, yeah, you're gonna have a little bit of trouble. Ooh, catch a worm. That's not a worm. This is a worm. That. Why is there worm inside a granite biome anyway? I feel like it should be a granite worm, and it should have triple the power of a normal worm, and that way, if you use it, you just instantly win the game. You know what I mean? What do you guys think about that? Do you guys agree or not agree with that? What is this? Is this something I need to know? It's done. It's done. nothing I need to know. Okay. So what is that? Is that a spider biome? Why is it so dark? I can't see shit, dude. Oh, it's just some... I'm like, I'm very confused by everything that's happening right now, but it's okay. What's up, mommy? Mom slime? I think personal kid? You're bad. You wanna play with me? That's what I fucking thought, dude. That's what I thought. Don't, don't play with someone you can't beat. That's the secret lesson I'm gonna give you guys right now. If you ever play games, make sure whoever you play games with, you can beat them. At all times, it's very, it's very important. Trust me. It's for your own well-being. We found our second granite biome already. It's kind of crazy that there's a second one. I don't know. I feel like, I feel like, I almost want to say I clicked on a large map, even though I know for one hundred percent fact that I clicked on a, a fucking what's it called a map, a medium map. I feel like I clicked on a large map just by the amount of content. There's so much content in this area. This is not good. But, I'll salvage it with my super amazing gaming skills. But now, bitches? You're never gonna get past me ever, 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 ever. You're never gonna get past me ever, ever. Okay, they're gonna get past me. Am I gonna die? You feel an evil presence watching you. Cthulhu, I can't! Cthulhu, I can't do it right now, okay? I'm, dude, I'm, I'm gonna die to a fucking slime. I have Cthulhu. I'm currently preoccupied. Okay, I'm currently busy. Uh, hello. Are you the evil presence? Lost goal. You're a friend, right? 
Hello. Oh. That's not a friend! It's not a friend! It's not a friend! I repeat, it's not a friend! You will never get this. Aha, uh -huh. what now, Mr. Fucking Lost Girl motherfucker? Lost Girl. Sit now it's a nymph. You were a lost girl, and now you're a nymph. What the fuck? You can't transform your body into something else? That is bullshit. Okay, I need to think about how am I gonna beat you? First of all, I need to think of a strategy. Strategy. So I need a way that you cannot hurt me, but I can hurt you, you know what I mean? I'm very low on HP, and like almost anything that hits me now will kill me. Okay, so I think what I need to do is first I need to heal up to max HP. That That's number one important. Okay, so let's put the HP region thing on instead of the enemy detection on. Okay. Now we're healing up HP a little bit faster. Let's pop a heal. Sweet. Last go. Oh, yes, 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 yes. Yes, go put yourself in a location where you fucked. Haha! -ha! What now, Mr. Lost Girl? Oh god, Lost Girl's going so far, guys. What must I do? I'm scared if I go, I'm gonna get like trapped by enemies and get destroyed. Kinda, where did the Lost Girl go? Yo, Lost, lo, lo, lost Girl? Hello? Yo, Nympho! Nympho Girl, where'd you go? Boy, we get every decision I've ever made my whole life. There's no way you can get up there, right? Slime is falling from the sky? Slime is falling from the sky. Fuck, I'm out. No, Cthulhu, you bitch. I wasn't ready. I wasn't ready, Cthulhu. I don't have a weapon to deal with you right now. Oh, I really don't have a weapon to deal with Cthulhu. Okay. This is going to be a very unfair fight, which we are probably going to lose. There's nothing we can do about it. It's just one of those situations. I wanted to come from the slime. And Cthulhu happened to be here. Now I'm going to die. That's fine. I can't do slime and Cthulhu. We cannot do slime and Cthulhu. I'm gonna die very soon. I kind of forgot about you, Cthulhu. I'm sorry. I was I wasn't paying attention to you, Cthulhu. I'm I get it. You're mad. You're mad that I wasn't paying attention to you. I'm so sorry. I'm out. Yo, get in here. Nope. Not in that one. This one. I'm dead. Okay. Ooh, that was. I could have made them fight Cthulhu for me. I'm so stupid. There's a tiny small possibility I maybe forgot Cthulhu was um, up there. I'm just saying. But, and the good news, I'm gonna respawn. And we're gonna farm some slime. Farm me some slime, having a time. So if I stand right here, I just never leave this place. All the slime will come to me eventually, and they will all die. Are you throwing them with fish? Are you throwing the slime with fish? I, I feel like you're throwing the slime with some fish. Zombie! Mr. Zombie, do we look like we have time for you? I'm in the middle of a freaking slime apocalypse. Apocalypse now, slime must style, you know what I'm saying? It's raining slime. Hallelujah, it's a raining slime. Amen. I don't actually know the lyrics for the raining slime song, but I feel like I should. I feel like there should be a raining slime theme song, just in case. So, yeah, I'm a little bit disappointed, sorry. Right? A bit disappointed. I feel like you uh, missed a golden opportunity to have. King Slime is working. That was not part of the game plan. We had a game plan. The game plan did not involve King Slime Awakening. So if King Slime Awakens is really bad, he's obviously super strong, he does a billion damage and stuff, but I'm just gonna, I'm gonna actually, I'm, gonna, I'm actually, I'm literally gonna attempt to try and tank beat the King Slime, because that's my base pet I've got. As you do hit the King Slime, he does, um, what's call it? He does, uh, what's he, uh, what's what I'm looking for? Yo, Molly! What's up? Heal me. Do, 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 uh, nope, not that. That one. I need this. Give me that. And I need, uh, that's it. That's it. G H R. I'm I'm dead. I got stuck and I couldn't push. I don't know what my quick key is for. Um, what's my color? I don't know what my quick key is for the iron skin potion. Buff. I need to figure that out, but I can't do anything right now. When you die in this game, you die for some. Oh, King Slime, you you come back. We fight you again. Okay, I can do it. Let's go. Oh, can I cheese you? Maybe I stand like right here. No, not really. Nope, not at all. I mean, if he doesn't despawn, I could get away with it. I could maybe get away with it if he doesn't despawn. Depending on how quick I can get. Oh my god, look at these guys just sitting there shooting at 8 trillion fucking spells. G it up. Okay. I mean, I feel like I'm gonna win this war, but at the same time, I've gotten down to half already. Oh, it's frustrating. He keeps getting me in like awkward positions, that's why. If I can just get away from these awkward positions I keep getting, I can kill him. I, can, I think I can actually beat the king slime. 
Okay, I think what we need to do is we need to run a little bit, start regening up as much as we can, and then fuck him up, fuck him up, and then get the fuck up. Nope. Dude, if he gets on top of me, I just insta die. I need him to not get on top of me, but he's so good at it. Problem is, I've only got a melee weapon. I don't have a fucking range weapon at all. Don't leave, King Slime, please. Yeah, he left. Fuck me, dude. I wasn't prepared for a King Slime boss fight. I'm not prepared for any boss fights right now. Like, I'm not in a position to fight it. I have not made a single arena for fighting anything. And I have not made any buffs or fucking stuff yet to fight anything. So, no boss slimes, please. I'm just trying to farm this fucking uh, slime. The raining slime. To get as much slime as I can, that's all. I was not specifically trying to fight the King Slime, even though I did a pretty good job. We're going down to like less than half. He's supposed to shrink in size, which makes him easy to fight. But he never shrank. That was odd. It's kind of weird. If this was standard though, he would have been dead. I would have killed him in the bottom. But unfortunately, it's not standard. It is, this ex it is expert mode, so he's a little bit stronger in expert mode, which is actually fine. But that's not, it's not a problem. I'm not too worried about him. He's, he's really easy. I can kill him super easily, but... Obviously, I need to be prepared. I need to have all the healing items. I need to have an arena that I can actually fight him in that's safe. And then I need to have the, uh, the correct items, which I obviously don't have. So. I must say, get on me very quickly. I was kind of impressed by how quickly he got on me. But. So I'm just going to continue uh, farming this um, slime day as much as I can. And then as soon as slime day is done, I'll end the episode. Depending how close I can get to Molly, I might be able to use Molly cheese to beat the King Slime. Why, is you, why are you in my base? Get out of my base. How did you even get in my base? King Slimes can't jump that high. I mean, normal Slimes can't jump that high. What am I saying? King Slimes. I just want to beat the King Slime now, that's why. Oh, sh I could have actually gone to damage and bought a bunch of grenades and just destroyed the King Slime, actually. Fuck, I'm an idiot. Yeah, I could have actually easily destroyed the King Slime. You you make a straight you make a straight ish path and then you have a bunch of grenades. Why is every door open? Is there a reason you guys all leave the doors open? I don't think it's very safe. I'm just gonna put it out there right now. I don't think it's very safe to leave the doors open. But I had like fucking many 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 times to king slime. The problem only problem with dying to king so many times is that almost all the gold I've been farming is gone. But that's okay. Like we don't care about gold too much. I think at all. So. I think I might need to build a battle arena next episode. I think maybe next episode we dedicate the episode to kind of farming a battle arena and setting up our strat while ba our like fighting zones. Because I, I have Cthulhu is starting to awaken and King Slime is starting to awaken. So with everything's starting to awaken. I feel like we I do at some point need to actually start working towards building a little bit of an arena area here close to my base. Just so that we have it. So if we need it in this type of situation, we can actually kill I Cthulhu slash kill our boy King Slime. So okay. both of those enemies aren't very suited for melee builds, and right now I'm obviously have a melee build because it's all I have. You know, it's not not a melee build by choice per se, but it's kind of more of a, a melee build where we ended up with, and are we just making making good use of it? I feel like the slime rain's over because I'm not seeing any more slimes falling from the sky. Never mind, they one just fall from the sky. Speak and these shall receive. But yeah, we can make this whole area here flat and pretty, and then we can also uh, make an arena for combat here for the uh, Aikathulu and stuff, and the and the Kingston. Easy, easy. Next time we see them, we'll kill him. Get the cool items. The Kingston's items suck, but the Aikathulu has like one one good item, I think, only. But I'm not after the items from the Aikathulu. I'm after the Demonite ore. Uh, the King Slime doesn't really give anything you want. He gives you like ninja gear, which is kind of nice. I kind of like the ninja gear, so that's fine. But uh, yeah, it's okay. Where's my buff button, by the way, game? Controls. No, not that. I want to controls. Controls. Buff, 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 in the middle of nowhere, it's really hard to get to. It just feels really stupid. Dude, does the slime event ever end? I want it to end now, please. 
I'm gonna end this episode, but the slime event's not ending. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna end the episode here, and I'm gonna go through the slime event by myself. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please be sure to hit that like button. It helps a lot in that video. Appreciate it. Subscribe if you want to see more in the future. And I'll see you guys next episode. We maybe kill a boss. Let's kill a boss next episode. Let's get let's get some action going. Let's get something happening. For now, thank you all very much for watching. I'll see you next time with more. So, right, if you enjoyed this episode, uh, maybe consider checking out my Patreon. Link in the description below. The benefits of the Patreon is really cool, as you can vote for your Patreon game. This game won via a default win. No one else voted, so it won. It was it's that simple, guys. And you could get that too, and get any playthrough you want on my channel uh, if you want to check it out. So, if you do, you know where to go. And I'll see you guys next time with more. Tomorrow, yeah.